Yay! I'm in the car. I just got done with the job interview. And... Um... I don't know. I'm just not real impressed with... Um, it's working in a convenience store, which I don't mind at all. I don't mind uh, manual labor at all. But... I don't know. I wasn't real impressed with this manager. So, I guess we're going to see. And yesterday I had a had a interview at um at our local grocery store, one of our local grocery stores. Not real impressed there either. You know, they've called me. I mean, this is like the fifth time I've applied there. So, I guess we'll see, but I sure have had a lot of interviews lately with no success at all. So I am going to stop here. I am going to show you the outside of our corn palace. Remember I told you I was going to? Um, just going to roll down the window and I'm going to turn this around. Okay, so there is the first picture all the way out here and you go up and there are domes up here that light up at night this is not a very good picture there's the front of it and that's where you go in I'm sorry guys this vlogging stuff is new to me so I'm not very good at it but I'm going to take off here and we're gonna to shut you off guys I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree and we're gonna walk around there for a little bit see you there okay I just stopped and got some gas so on we go to the dollar store my gas gauge was reading uh oh e uh oh e sorry for the bumpy ride I don't have you're just sitting on my dash. I don't have any uh, mounts or anything for you. I should go to Walgreens too, just to kind of walk around a little bit and show you what crappy stores I have in this town. May I know what we'll do. We'll go to, I'm hoping my batteries hold out long enough to take you to Kmart because they are closing and they are gonna be closing in just about a week or two. So I want to see what kind of bargains they have there, <clears throat> which I have no money to anyway, but I'm going to, we're going to look around. Doesn't hurt to look, right? And it's always when people have the best sales that I don't have any money, you know. But I'm getting really sick of this forced no buy thing. I, um, I need a job where I can actually... You know, because the money that I make right now is going towards my rent and my my phone and my cable, and I don't even have enough for that. So I really, honestly, don't know what I'm going to do this month. I don't even have enough for my rent right now. My they're calling me and bitching at me about my cable bill, and um, I'm actually got a good price on my cable because. If I would even go down to basic cable, it would cost me more than I'm paying right now. And I've got um, pretty good cable. I mean, I don't have any of the, the super stations like HBO or anything like that. But, um, you know, I have like sci-fi and I have the cooking channels and, you know, the stuff that I like. So, I would just be happy with with that, you know. And I, and I, I save and spend on Netflix 
you know, so I would be happy with basic cable. But until, you know, this deal runs out, I had it for a couple of years or something, you know, so I think like the, the end of the summer, that deal runs out, and then I'll just go to basic cable. And I love my DVR, or my TiVo, or whatever you call it. But God dang it, I need a job, and this is getting kind of ridiculous that... I can't find a frickin' job. You know, I've had all of these um, interviews. I, I apply to at least two different places every single week. I've applied to about every place in this damn town. And I can't find a job. Except for a little measly part-time stuff. Okay, I'm going to turn you around. Here's my dollar tree. Trying to see and drive at the same time is not good. This is my Dollar Tree, and it's a new store. Basically new store, but boy. So there aren't a lot of people in there, so I'm going to shut you off until I get inside. Okay, here we are. This is the first aisle as you walk in the door. I don't they even have downy, but geez, they're tiny. This stuff is all new. Easter stuff. They must just be going to put out this stuff. And starting on their planting stuff. This is all of their card stuff here. I never go down this aisle. It's cute. All their little toys. See, I don't go down this aisle either. This is just cards and stuff. love to get one of these bird feeders for the birds outside my window but I don't really have a tree right outside my window so stickers I don't do that anymore Let's see what's on the end here garage sale stuff and their pens and their office stuff I hope I'm not going too fast for you guys if I see somebody I'm gonna have to stop This, um, there's paper clips, all that kind of stuff. I use these for a few of my um, perfumes and stuff like that at home. Let's see if they got any adult coloring books. They have lots of like. Um, Oh, the word search that my mom does. Books. Okay, that looks good. I have food up there. But my cat does not eat that stuff. Here's the glassware. all their picture frames, mirrors, etc. I almost think that I wouldn't mind putting one of these up. There I am. Hello. Putting one of these up behind my camera. Candle holders. Sorry about that. 
somebody who was come, had come into the aisle and was giving me a look. There's all of their containers. Cute stuff for outside. I will, um, if I have any money later, I will. I usually try to get something from here. Candles and renews it and all that stuff. All the cleaning supplies here. Still more cleaning supplies up ahead, brooms and mops. And speed up here a little. Okay, we're getting to the other stuff now. Put you in my hand, sorry. For jumping you around. There's the hair dye everybody's talking about, but I don't know. I just don't. Uh, trust that on my hair. This is all the socks and stuff like that. I'm afraid I'm going to run out. Are you ready for the makeup department? That's it. Turn you off for a second. There's some more scary. Here we go again. Here's Q tips. Again, here it is. You can see the whole thing right there. That's my beauty. And there was nothing new from the last time I saw it. There's all the vitamins and stuff <laughs> um, lotions. Just starting in on the food here. Which I don't think we need to even go down. I do love these things. I like the Italian ices actually. More food. Some of their stuff in their frozen department is really not bad. More food. Gatorade. So I've had um, one of their breakfast meals before and it's not too bad. I mean it's just, here's the glassware. And the last aisle is like towels. And um, Ziplocs and garbage bags and tin stuff to make meals. I'm going to let you guys go because I'm getting the front of the store. This here is all like silverware and stuff like that. Okay, that is it for the Dollar Tree. Um, and we are on our way to Kmart. Sorry about all the bumps again. My hair is taking a licking today because it is so horribly windy here really windy so my hair is all over the place it did look good when I started out <laughs> but not so much now so anyway I, mean, I hardly ever go out to the stores anymore so that was the first time I'd gone to our Dollar Tree and like forever I mean it's been a couple of months at least at the minimum since I've been there and nothing really had changed 
you know, all they did was change out their holiday stuff, really. Which is kind of disappointing, you know, our, our stores suck. Okay, here's Kmart, and I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film in here, but I'm going to try to do at least like the makeup items or, or you know, some big sale items. So I'm going to let you go until we get in there. Okay. <laughs> Hi guys, they wouldn't let you in the store with me. Um, there's a big sign right inside the door that says uh, no cameras or recording devices allowed. They're only open for another week, and I got um, a couple of things. I got four lipsticks for a dollar fifty a piece. Three of them are the Sh Oh Sugar from CoverGirl. I got the Punch. They're normally um, six ninety nine. I got them for a dollar fifty, dollar forty nine actually. Um, the Punch. I got the which looks like this. I got the jelly that looks like this. I got the sprinkle that looks like this. I got a Milani. This was $1.49 also in 8 Ruby Valentine. It's very red. And then I got this for a dollar. This was um, step to top coat from Sinful Shine. I did not see that step two though, so I don't know. Is this a gel? Anybody that knows, tell me. Sinful Shine top coat is all it says. But anyway, I wanted to show you guys what I got. Um, I shouldn't have bought anything, but for crying out loud, dollar, dollar forty nine for those for Milani and those CoverGirl ones. Um, I've never, I don't have any of this old sugar ones, so I don't know if they work or not, but they, it is so noisy in there. They're tearing all the, the partitions down and, and um, they've got a lot of clothes, well, not a lot of clothes left. They don't have hardly any, they've got one wall of makeup is all left. Um, Oh, starting to rain. One wall of makeup left is all, and that was just bits and pieces, and it was, it was mixed in with, um, oh, like bath stuff and um, nail stuff. So they really, they hardly had anything left. They had just a couple Milani lipsticks left in really funky colors, but I really like that red. And then they had um, five O Sugar ones left and those are the only three that I come close to even liking. Um, um, some guy just about hit me. <laughs> oh, I don't know what else to do now. Um, I wanted to take you with me, darn it. But I know not everything was from their store. I mean, they had to have gotten a bunch of stuff from other stores. So I'm gonna move it over a little bit, see if I can get rid of some of that wobbling. I am going to um, go get a taco, I think. And then go home. So, I will talk to you in a little bit. Bye.